If this is your first time, if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. If you might not know me, my name is Phoebe and this video is our traditional monthly legal updates video. I'm going to share with you the new laws that concern you as an expat foreigner immigrant living in Germany. So without further ado, let's get right into it. First, as I always do, I start with the Corona updates. Now, um, the mask obligation was cancelled for the month of in the month of um, February. Now in the month of March, healthcare um, workers, staff at the healthcare facilities do not have to wear the mask. I went to see my eye doctor today. Today is the 13th of March. I went to see them and the staff were still wearing masks. So I think it depends on which staff is doing what or which um, facility is doing what. But you do not have to wear the mask. And you don't have to test when you go to the healthcare facilities. But as I'm seeing, some healthcare facilities are actually still doing it to keep everyone safe. Right. Now, that is it with the corona updates. Number two is for students. Listen, if you're a student and you were matriculated already by the 1st of December 2022. I'm sorry, I have to put my phone on silent. So, if you're already matriculated by the 1st of December 2022, this is for you. You are eligible to apply for the energy relief money worth 200 euros, okay? So, first you have to get your Bundes ID. Some universities have already, you know, given their students the login details and everything that all kinds of information that you need for that. So it doesn't matter if you are still studying or not, but if by, the, by December 2022, you are already a student, then you can definitely go ahead and apply for it. If, um, yeah, I think I'm going to do a separate video on that. I'm going to put it on TikTok though. So follow me on TikTok. It's um, the Phoebe Way, the same tag, I mean the same handle. The same handle on the Phoebe, uh, on TikTok. So follow the Phoebe on TikTok for those short informations. I will still put it on Instagram and also on YouTube, but YouTube will be short. So look out for the shorts tab on the channel. So that is it for students. Another thing that concerns those of us who do not drive only cars, but have mopeds, have e-scooters, scooters, and you have them licensed or they are ones that have to be licensed. The new law says that you have to make sure that you have the insurance. So have to fleet liability insurance for these are they vehicles? You know what I'm saying. I'm trying to say like those little machines. <laughs> well, yes. Yeah, so e-scooters, mopeds, scooters, make sure that you have the insurance. And for the year 2023, the license plate is black. Next year, the color will change to make it easier for the authorities to control those of you who want to swerve it. So please make sure that you have that. Yes. This month does not have a lot of updates. The, the last thing that you should know that concerns all of us is that the last Sunday of March is going to be, I believe, the 26th of March. Let me be sure. It should be the 26th of March. Yes, the last Sunday being the 26th of March, we are going to move forward an hour. So from 1.59, it does not go to 2 a.m., but from 1.59, it goes to straight to 3 a.m. That is also another thing that has to do with the daylight saving. Remember in October, we slept an hour longer that Sunday. Now it's time to pay back that one hour. So we skip an hour. That is it. The Phoebe way is here to give you the information to make your life in Germany easier. And I hope that you find this channel helpful. If you do, please do like, comment, subscribe, and share this, these videos and information to all, all of your contacts. Okay. To all of your contacts. Yes. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you same time next Sunday. Latest by next month, but no. Yes, I'll try to put out all the information as, out as soon as possible. So yes, thank you so much for watching and catch you on the next one. Bye.